This is an introduction video to your work report format. Not only do we provide you work reports with your marketing campaign with us, but we also tell the story behind it and let you know how we quantify the work that's been done. So in this tutorial, we're going to introduce you to the reporting format and how to re interpret the reports that we give to you. On this video demonstration, what we're going to be going over is not going to be your exact report. So there may be some features or some work in this report that does not apply to your marketing campaign. So please keep that in mind. What I'm going to be going over is explaining to you how to interpret the report yourself and how we quantify the different work categories of work that has been done because we use a very unique way to quantify the work that's been done which is called the brand expansion factor our goal is to get your brand bigger better and more powerful online by optimizing your brand publishing content out there about you and establishing more credibility in the eyes of Google, Yahoo, Bing, and other search engines, which will translate into higher rankings and more traffic over time. So we quantify the work that's been done, total each type of work that we've done, add up a summary of work done, and we call that the brand expansion factor. Then we put these into different levels to chart your expected progress over time and talk about anticipated performance to manage your expectations. So with that introduction, just to get through this real quickly, we let you know the goals that have been set, and the first thing we want to do is get through your site to make sure that it's search engine compliant. So your report will go through and give you an overview of the different things that we have accomplished to make your website search engine compliant, which has to do with making sure that whenever your website shows up in the search engines that the page title and meta descriptions make sure uh, are displaying properly and written properly to make sure that you have the right amount of content on your site talking about the subject matter that matches what people are typing in to find you. We also make sure that we do a security check and backup of your site. We'll make sure that your website is uh, that we generate sitemaps. We let the search engines know how many pages you have on your site and what those pages are so that people can find you. And any miscellaneous tasks that we may, may have accomplished during making sure that your website is search engine compliant. And then we also make sure that we set up uh, tracking systems through Google and Bing to make sure that we are able to track your traffic and any issues that may arise within your site and, of course, your performance online. We make sure that your website blog is set up properly and we make sure that authorship is established on your blog. We want to make sure that whenever things are published on your website that Google knows who's publishing that and we accomplish that through setting up Google authorship and what we call publishership on your website. It just adds more credibility in Google's eyes of your website. So we want to at this point in time uh, say congratulations on your report to let you know that your website is now search engine compliant and that you're ready to join the online marketing race. But before then, we need to set up some accounts that we can publish into to get your brand expanded. We do some research ahead of time and we'll let you know what research we do before we set up accounts for you online and with your social media. We check for duplicates and we also check to make sure that if you already have some accounts set up, that the information is correct about your business. To be able to expand your brand online, we publish through what we call your brand network and we set that up. We set that up by setting up the top off-site blogs and we let you know which ones they are, your top social media accounts and we'll let you know which ones those are, and top social sharing accounts online as well. And we document all of these to you in the report that we provide to you and the initial business directories that we set up. And after we're done setting all those up, we have what we call your brand network established online, which means that we're now ready to expand your brand online through the accounts that we've set up. We start with your brand expansion by creating unique content to expand your website itself, since that's what we're trying to drive traffic towards. But when we, when we add new pieces of content to your website, who knows about it? Luckily, because we're marketing you, the world does. And we, ex we let the world know what's going on with you and your website expansion through the top blogs that we set up, the social sharing accounts, the social media accounts, and co by continuing to expand business directories. So on the top off-site blogs that we have set up, we'll let you know how many publications we've made into those to expand your brand, and we'll total those for you and let you know what quantity of publications we've made. Similarly with your social media accounts, we'll let you know what's, what's the direction in terms of your customers and how they find you through your social media and we'll let you know how many social media publications we've made to expand your brand and we'll let you, we'll, we'll 
give you proof of work that's been done on those, and we'll give you a total number count of how many publications we've made. Similarly for social sharing, same thing. We'll get through it. We'll let you know how many we published, and we'll give you a total count. In terms of expanding your brand through business directories, we'll let you know how many have been created, and we'll let you know exactly what those are in the list and summarize them for you. And then in terms of external blog social interaction, we'll comment on other blogs and join conversations to keep your brand stimulated outside of your brand network. We'll let you know what we've done and we'll total the count for you so that you know how many times we published your brand online outside of what we call your brand network. Then we take a look at your brand expansion factor at the end of each quarter and we'll total up the different types of work that we did in each service and each publication category and that's your brand expansion factor. We will take that brand expansion factor and we're going to put it into brand expansion levels based on the factor quantities that we're able to attain each quarter. Now, currently on your first quarter, you'll be at a level of one on your brand expansion, but we want to ideally see you at a level of six. So to get to a level of six, you'd be starting out at level one during the first quarter. It would take to get to the ideal level of six for optimal campaign performance 18 months. But in the time being, you're probably really curious to know, well, how is my campaign going to perform in the meantime? During the first quarter, you should expect your website to be in a transitionary period with how the search engines are viewing the changes that we made to your site. And we've just started publishing and expanding your brand online throughout month two and three. So you're still in transitionary period. Really through month three and month from month really two to month four, if you will, we're going to see a, a, a large increase in an expansion of improvements in rankings online. And then from month four through month seven, we're going to see a, a, a steady period until we get to what we call our breakout because we continue to expand your brand and publish more about you and it gains momentum up through what we call our breakout period through month seven and then it's smooth sailing towards the end. So you're going to start seeing some notable increases in traffic come around month seven or even sooner. This is a conservative way to manage your expectations on this. So this is your first quarterly report to let you know that you're well on your roadmap to success and we're currently at level one in your brand expansion and we look forward to getting to level six and we look forward to the next check-in at the end of the second quarter in this report format type.